It appears some of the players out there, like Kellen Winslow, who you heard from first, and then especially TJ Hushmanzada, who is next, prefer the real world to the virtual version when it comes to football. TJ, so unhappy with his new player rating, as you heard, he has vowed to boycott Madden until the rating is changed. Here to talk Madden 10 and those player ratings, Madden creative director Ian Cummings and designer Donnie Moore from EA Sports. Now, guys, you just heard two players, just a little bit from them, not exactly happy. Give us some idea. This is something I've always wondered. How are those play player ratings determined? I mean, the player ratings, the way they're uh, determined, we watch almost every single game of every single year. We get NFL reports and scouting reports straight from the NFL sources. And we basically read as much information as we possibly can. And it all starts off, obviously, when they come into the league as a rookie. You know, we have all the combine reports. We have all of the scouting reports from those organizations. So we, you know, we kick it off where they get drafted. And then from there, their player statistics and how they do on the field is going to determine their rating in Madden and the future versions of Madden. To be clear, this, this isn't new at all either. You know, this isn't the first player we've had uh, complaints from. So it's something we deal with. Players don't call us and tell us how great they're rated. Uh, it's always something that's pretty often so. It's just like TV. Nobody tells you when you're doing a good job, but they're always yeah. there to tell you when there's uh, something they're not happy about. Right. So, so keeping that in mind then, what are the chances that you would go back and change TJ or another player's rating after you, releasing the game? Oh, we, we make changes all the time. Well, as, we, as they're playing, right? It, it, it updates as they're, as they're playing as the season goes on. Right, absolutely. I mean, it's all about we have roster updates that almost happen every single week, and that's determined solely on the fact that on their performance on the field. But would so you if change TJ it? Come, would you if change TJ it before, comes in though? And, uh, no, we have no plans to change the rating right now. We no. feel that TJ is um, being portrayed in the game very uh, accurately with his attributes. Well, I want to bring TJ in because I can't really speak uh, for him. So we welcome TJ Hushmanzada to first take also. TJ, we know you were on with Colin Coward the other day. Now you've got the guys who do the game. They're right here. Go ahead, tell Ian and Donnie what you're thinking. It's not right. Yeah, I heard everything they just said. They're not right. They're not telling the truth. If they are telling the truth, the information they're getting is wrong. What did, uh, what did we get wrong? I guess that's the key one yeah, to get it, down TJ, to. Is it, it speed? Is that yeah, it? Yeah, there's 50 ratings that we got to get okay. absolutely accurate. So you got you to gotta pinpoint which ones are wrong for us. I mean, I'll be, I'll be real. My overall rating is okay. It's fine. I wouldn't complain about that. You're 10th, TJ, over, overall. You're 10th right now. But what are there's speed? There's so many other things like el elusiveness. What, what are the ones that you're not happy with? I, I probably dropped the least amount of balls in the league close to it at the top every year. So my hand should be, my catch should be very high. My speed should be much. I mean, there's linebackers on the game faster than me. Guys? Any, well, any I mean, response I guess, to I guess, it? I guess, <laughs> I guess I guess I'll go to a couple. I'll pull out a couple uh, a, a couple stats for you. I mean, four six one combine. Obviously, that was years ago, so we won't we no, won't hang, hey, hang well, on to you too look, long for that. I'm gonna cut uh, you off. Two, I'm gonna cut you off. Okay, right go now. ahead. Shoot, shoot. Uh, I got some more stats for you. Hey, 100 percent wrong. Bet your bank account. That is not that four six one oh. combine. 100 percent wrong. I don't know if you want my bank account, TJ. <laughs> hey, hey, I can use. Hey, I can use everything that I can get. Um, but I'll go. I'll go back to 2004. Your yards per catch has declined every single year since 2004, and you haven't had a 50 yard catch since 2004. That's the offense I'm in. I'm gonna show you guys this year. It's the offense well, that I'm in. Well, I guess, I guess what we're saying, TJ, is uh, years before, we've kind of given the benefit of the doubt to players. So they might have, you know, looked good on one play or maybe a couple plays during the season. So we're like, okay, give him 90 speed. This year with Madden NFL 10, we wanted to really hit on the strengths and the weaknesses of the player like never before. So for, your, for, for example, for you, obviously speed, I think you could ask any NFL GM around the league. They're not going to say speed is your number one attribute, and that's, and that's why you're in the league. They're going to point to your route running. They're going to point to the way you can go over the middle and catch everything and, and your hands. And in Madden NFL 10, you're rated 97, 96, and 98, and I believe in all three of those categories, which is top three in the league, which makes you that 91 overall. Okay, now, now I want to go back to the combine four six one. Who gave you that information? <laughs> we, uh, we scour the in, we scour the uh, the internets for the uh, for those types of uh, information. That was obviously like five or six years ago, so and, and it's hard to get that info. TJ, I'm going to kind of jump in here. Hold on, TJ, I just want to jump in here for a minute. Uh, you, outside of that, I mean, obviously you've got some discrepancy with some of the numbers. These guys aren't going to change anything. I want to yeah. ask you what because you said I'm going to go out and show you this season when I go play with the Seahawks. What needs to happen for you to lift this boycott on Madden? What what needs to happen for you to start playing again? Okay, let me just go back real quick, Dana, and I'll tell you. 
last year, how did you go from last year being a, I don't know what I was speed-wise, but I was at least eight, nine points faster to go back to the 50-yard catch? I don't think anybody on the Bengals had a 50-yard catch last year, but I bet there are receivers. But, TJ, what I'm saying, they're not, they're not going to change your number right now. They flat out said it. So I'm asking you, what, if anything, can happen now? Because they won't change the number. From this point on, what will get you back playing Madden? Oh, I'm going to just show them. I'm going to show them. I'm going to show them. I know Madden comes up with updated. They'll update the rosters uh, <laughs> the day after the final cuts are made. So when updated rosters are uh, updated and we play a couple games and I'm on a new team, a new offense, I can show them better than I can tell them, and that's what I'm going to do. Wait, yeah, where does your overall number have to be for you to start playing again, though? Do you have one? Oh, my, you're overall, you know, you're okay with your 91, you're the 10th guy. You just want some of those other numbers a little higher, mm -hmm. then you'll start playing? I'm faster than 81 speed. They can get all this hoopla about the combine number and this and that. Anybody that knows me and knows what I ran, they can say whatever they want to say. GM can say this and GM can Half of the GMs in the NFL don't know what they're doing anyway. So, so the so the one thing I'd like to throw out there is that we did this is nothing personal at all, TJ. And I'm almost thinking, thanking goodness, it's you at 91 overall that's coming and complaining because we did this with every single player in the league. We lowered everybody down. We stretched out the ratings. So, the elite players are still there, but there's a lot less a lot less of them. Uh, you know what's funny though? I, I don't. I'm not taking it personal at all. It, it was funny when I was asked a question, and. Uh, I just answered it. I didn't. I didn't think nothing of it. I didn't think it was. <laughs> you, I really didn't. DJ, you didn't know it was going to turn into this. We appreciate you coming on to talk to these guys, and we will watch your number once things get underway and we see those numbers change. Thank you, though, for talking to the guys on EA Sports from EA Sports. We appreciate it. EA Sports, thank you, man. Tell them to get your information correct, man, because <laughs> I did not even run at the combine, man. I just had to throw that to you, man. <gasps> Oh, guys, I, I, I'm going to throw you in a different direction here because we've got Patrick Creighton here who also uh, oh, no. wants to weigh in. Uh -oh. do you, guys, do you think he's going to be happy with his number? Patrick? Yeah. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take a wild guess and guess Patrick will be a little unhappy. Patrick, do you know what you, I can't see you over there. but I, I, want, the, I want the guys to tell me uh, my rating. I think I've heard, but I want them to just spot out some of the numbers and where they're getting information from. <laughs> Wow, well, you're killing like them on like this TJ information. If you're, just, if you're basing speed on what someone ran when they first came in the league, uh, a lot of scouts make that mistake and they miss out on it. Oh, no, 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 absolutely not. Like, I mean, that, you go right to the Jerry Rice example, right? Like, okay. Jerry Rice ran the 4 6 5 40, and obviously he's a, when he, he, played, the he played the game, you can't compare he never anybody got, else to Jerry Rice. Well, right, well, but the point is that the, the combine, we don't, to, we don't solely take that combine and turn that into a speed. Okay. We use game speed. Game speed is what we you know, try to go after. It's a combination. I mean, it's a combination of you using that combine number plus game speed, and it factors into a number that you guys determine. Okay, so yeah, where, 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 where are my hands at right now? I believe we have your hands at a, approximately 86. I don't have the numbers right in front of me, but 86, 87, which is Appreciate again, that's probably going to put you in the top 20, 25 receivers in the league. Yeah, you all right with that, Patrick? No, I'm, I'm very unhappy. With that. I'm, <laughs> well, I've never been considered a B hand guy, but I, I guess according to the EA guys. Are you going to still well, play, Patrick? I'll still play, but uh, they got to send me a free copy. <laughs> <laughs> guys, I think, I, go ahead, go ahead. I was going to say, I mean, it, again, a lot of it's statistic based. So you know, okay. you, you know, the minute you start putting those numbers up in game, we will immediately start making numbers go up. And on the flip side, if we have Andre and, and cover boy Larry Fitzgerald, 98 and 99 respectively, right. if, they, if they don't start producing, they're going to go down. I mean, it's not, we okay. don't play favorites, and we're trying to really capture the NFL as, most, you know, as best we can. Okay, so, so why, why did my hands go down drastically from a 90-something uh, last year to an 86 this year? Can you tell me why? Because I can tell you the, the number of drops I had this year. No, well, again, like I said, the, the, the big thing we did this year was stretching the ratings out. So unless you were a 99 or a 98 or a, a 95 from last year, everybody went, you know, went down Because you got to have somewhere to right. go you up. Could, you, yeah, you, exactly. said, you said you based it on information. What was the drops I had? Please tell me. No, I think, Patrick, what they're saying is uh, huh? the change now between the end of last year yeah, yeah, and this yeah. year is because they're stretching those ratings out because you got to have somewhere to go. If you finish last season at, okay. at that, I, I saying they're, they yeah, want they're just planning on updating them week by week. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Like this, th we treated everybody. We put everyone in a vacuum and didn't, ha and we took no stats into account, and we lowered everybody down because we, we in the past, we didn't do a very good job of okay. using the whole scale of the ratings. For example, last year with cornerbacks, every single cornerback in the league was between 87 and 99 speed. So, 
We okay. stretched that out this year. Patrick, right. thanks for weighing in. I, we we got to wrap this up, guys. I feel like we, and TJ, thank you also for coming on and joining us, guys. I feel like you took a little bit of a beating here, but I, I appreciate you. I appreciate you joining us because it was questions that people had out there, and you know everybody's going to be playing, and you may even get TJ back as well. He'll be back. <laughs> thanks, guys. So. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.